Greetings, everyone. Post-Equinox message from the Earth Allies. Are you ready? Love is real. As decreed by us, the company of heaven, the changes are now to begin occurring very quickly. We love you. You see, the starships are up there right now, calculating who on this planet is real and ready to advance. Everything else which is not real will just disappear. Love is all there is, and the only thing that everything will be is love. The love within connected to the all, that is the reality, and this is inevitable too. Our responsibility is to assist all of humanity right now to focus on the light and the truth instead of the nothing of duality. For in duality they receive nothing. In love, humanity receives everything. Love is the focus. This is the most important truth on this planet to share with others. Indeed, we say this is the mission. Through word of mouth, through all avenues of communication, be love and say love. For as this occurs, the energy of love is contagious. In truth, this is already occurring. Love is everybody equal. Everybody, everyone, being present in the moment of now. As 5D thought shows you, the God you are, equally present and awakened. Spread the word equal joy. Have we mentioned that each being on this planet will get to sit in their own captain seat of their own starship? Just an FYI. Love is here. The world of illusion dissolves. And all which remains is a living planet unified. This is planet Earth equal heart's destiny unfolding right now. And there is absolutely nothing the darkness or denser energies can do about it. Love is here. The love army is at the forefront. Freedom is granted. Real love is simply this. Love is real because it is whole. Peace is real because it is balance. God is real because he, she, is eternal. What is not eternal, whole, and balanced is not real. It does not exist and has no consequence at all. Our task is to reveal what is real. As we do this, we reveal the nature of what isn't. It is that simple. Spirituality is not an escape. Its function is to lead to the truth. You see, even an ego can use spirituality for its own purposes, just as anything else. Fear is nothing more than a self-imposed block to the experience of real love. In illusion, humanity chose to see themselves contrary to who they truly were. Now, this is all changing. Because, in truth, humanity is the experience of love, light, brilliance, and truth. Fear, the shadow and cave humanity has been hiding in, is an attempt to block the vision of themselves, to not see themselves as they truly are, which is stepping outside of the cave. Humanity has convinced themselves they're weak, vulnerable, and open to attack. The opposite is actually true. What is created whole cannot be divided, but can be falsely perceived 
And this is the role of fear. False evidence appearing real, covering the light and brilliance of humanity truly is. To perceive perfection as imperfect and to see what is really true reality as false is the ego program mind attempting to cover up love, brilliance, light, and truth. All of humanity is pure light, truth, and love. Indeed, the human condition has been pain and suffering. And as we have shared, all of that has been an illusion. One can choose to live in the experience of oneness, or one can choose to live in the fantasy of isolation and separation. We ask you, which one has the greatest love in it? The one equal now. Planet Earth equal heart is going to somewhere no planet has gone before. And this includes all that are upon her. You see, the light shot a broadside into the corner where darkness was hiding and lit it up. Now, what darkness? Yep, we are here. And we are real. The feelings of joy will be increasing exponentially as the truth that we are here quickly seeps into humanity's hearts. This is an inevitable event for humanity to meet their parents of creation here with them in the physical manifest. Most are not even aware of this upcoming event. It's going to be a surprise or maybe a shock. Humanity may have its quirks, but humanity is still oneness equal love. And that's a no matter what. We love you unconditionally, and we are so in love with humanity. Love Mother and Father God, Amun Ra, and the Earth Allies. Quoted from Albert Einstein. There are two ways to live your life. One is as though nothing is a miracle. The other is as though everything is a miracle. We love you.